and welcome back to Interactive Writing. I thought we could reread what we wrote yesterday and then we can erase it and write about a different kind of weather. So let's first reread what we wrote yesterday. Here we go. The weather is sunny. The sun makes things bright. All right, let's erase and think about what's another kind of weather that we could write about. Oh, mm-hmm. I hear rainy, I hear snowy, I hear windy. All right, let's write about snowy. Let's write about the snow. Let's see, let's write first. Look at the snow. How many words? Yep, four. Say it with me. Look at the snow. Let's draw our four lines for our four words. Here we go. Look at the snow. All right, what's our first word? Yes, look, that is a snap word. Can you find it on your snap, snap word chart? Yep, it's an orange word, there it is, L-O-O-K. -okay. But it's the first word in the sentence. So we need to make the first letter a capital letter. So capital L and then all of the other letters are lower case letters. Here we go, let's reread it. Look at, at is a snap word. Yep, there it is. Go ahead and write it. A-T, at. Look at the snap word. There it is, it's a red word. This is a pretty easy sentence, isn't it? All right, here we go. Look at the snow. Hmm, that one is a chopping word. Here we go. Sno. Write it. And then I'll write it and you can check it. All right, here we go. Snow. Sno. And we're gonna put a period at the end. Look at the snow. Do you remember yesterday I taught you about twin sentences? Do you remember when we want to write two sentences? We can write twin sentences. We can take the idea at the end of that sentence to start the idea of the next sentence. So what else could we say about snow? Let's start our sentence like this. Snow, ah, that's what we could write. Somebody said, snow is cold. Let's say it together, snow is cold. How many words? Yep, three. Say it with me again. Snow is cold. Let's draw our three lines. Snow is cold for our three words. What's our first word? Yep, it's snow. We already wrote it here, so we just have to copy it, except we have to make sure that the S is a capital letter, because look, there's our period. So the first letter in the next sentence has to be a capital letter. So make sure you make your S a capital S. Here we go. Let's reread our sentence to see what comes next. Snow is, snap word. There it is. All right. Snow is cold. Let's chop it. K old, cold. You write it. Write each sound that you hear. All right, check it with me. K old. Look at the snow. Snow is cold. So what are we gonna draw in our picture? Mm-hmm. Yeah, I think so too. A snowman, right? All right, so we're gonna have to draw the snowman, which is like three circles. And I'm gonna give mine a carrot nose, and two eyes. I'm gonna give mine a hat and some buttons. And I'm gonna use some like branches for um, his arms. And then I'm gonna draw a, a girl or a boy to some kid like making the snowman. So here's the kid's head and their body. 
And I know that in the winter, people wear hats because it's cold. So here's their hat. And um, there's their face, okay. And oh, they wear mittens. Let's see, there's the mittens. Oh, and they wear a scarf. So I'm gonna add that detail. Oh, it looks just like someone in this, in the, except they didn't have any legs. There. Oh, it looks just like the snow. Look at the snow. Snow is cold. Does our picture match our words? Yeah. All right, great. So now we've written a page about sunny weather. We've written a page about snowy weather. What kind of weather do you think we'll write about tomorrow? Come back tomorrow and you will find out.